Easter Sunday. Hi. <laughs> Three weeks from Jordan getting back on the boat. Woohoo! everyone and happy Easter to those who celebrate it. Today officially marks three weeks until I leave for my contract which is absolutely insane so I figured I would pick up my camera and vlog for the day since this is the last holiday I will be celebrating at home for quite a while probably almost a year so um, not too much is going on today but I am going to brunch with my parents which I'm really excited for so I made myself coffee of course and we're gonna just get ready together kind of just chill out today so like i said i'm leaving three weeks from today my flight is actually at like 6 a.m which is so early but um yeah i leave three weeks from today there's still so much i need to get done before i leave and the last week is pretty much going to be a week of staying home <laughs> just so I'm extra safe and I have to get my PCR test like three days before I leave. So I'm not really gonna be doing much the last week, but especially now, like already, I'm not really doing too much because I wanna stay super healthy and ready to go. But I haven't started packing at all. I still have so many things I have to go out and buy, like toiletries and things like that. It doesn't feel like real life. Like it does, and I've already done this before, so I'm prepared to leave, but at the same time, it's been so long that I'm like, I'm just not in the swing of like not being home. I feel like I've mentioned it before, but I am from New York State and our governor just announced last week that this upcoming week, anyone who's 16 or older is eligible to schedule and receive the COVID vaccine, which is very good news. If I can find it anywhere around me, I'm gonna try and get the Johnson & Johnson vaccine because it's a one dose vaccine and then I will already have been vaccinated before I even leave for my contract and that'll just give me more peace of mind. So I guess we will find out next week I have been like vlogging everything so you'll be in the loop about what's going on. I also mentioned before that I choreographed a girl at the rink short program but I just found out last week that I'm going to be choreographing her long program so that's really fun but it's also kind of hectic because I have to do it in like two weeks. Starting tomorrow I'm going to go at it and start the program already so that is going to be a little bit crazy, but I am excited and I mean, I'm already going to be at the rink anyways, so I might as well. I'm really trying to think of what else is new in my life because there's like so much going on, but at the same time, like there's not really any new updates besides work. Oh, I have another hair appointment in like a week or two and I think I'm going to just bite the bullet and go back to brunette. And like, obviously, as you could see, it's very blonde right now. And the last time I got it done, I wanted to go brunette. And it kind of did. But then after one wash, it already faded back to blonde. So I will insert a picture so you know what I mean. And I just feel like it's going to suit me better. And also, it's going to be way less maintenance, especially because I'm leaving. And last time, it was a disaster, like a literal train wreck trying to find a hairdresser in Fort Lauderdale to do my hair on turnaround days. This is pretty much it for my makeup because I'm not trying to go too crazy. We're literally just going to like a little diner so my outfit will be extra enough. Here we have it. My makeup is done. Very, very simple. Um, kind of like a no makeup makeup look. I'm going to wait on my lips because that is fully dependent on my outfit. So here is the final Easter fit. This is actually my mom's. I'm just wearing a cream blouse and then this cute little skirt and then I've got some heels on. So yeah, ready to go. Okay, here she is. <laughs> Here's her Easter fit. You do the same pose every time. Whatever, I don't know if it's a good, I'll do my. She's limited, she's full. <laughs> Back in her day, that was the pose. There we go. Uh -oh. Cheers. We 
are back from brunch. We stopped at Starbucks on the way home because it was literally right across the street and I really wanted coffee. So I got my usual order and we literally don't have anything else planned for the rest of the day, but it's so sunny out. So I don't know if I'm going to go rollerblading or maybe just go for a walk or something like that. Um, but I made a little bit of a mess trying to pick out what outfit I was going to wear for brunch. So I'm going to clean that up really quickly. A little time at tiny. Not gonna lie, it's been a minute since I rollerbladed and that was so much fun. It's like the perfect day for outdoor activities because it's like 60 and sunny but there's no wind so it just feels amazing. It's a very comfortable temperature um, but obviously I'm back home. I just poured myself a little glass of kombucha. Um, do you guys like kombucha? Let me know. I feel like people are really hit or miss with it. This is like the watermelon flavor maybe from Synergy. I don't know. I really like it. It's a nice little treat, but it's 6.06 .06 and I'm honestly still not really that hungry. Like brunch was very filling. So I'm not sure what I'll make for dinner. Maybe I'll just, you know, throw together a little salad or something. Um, having myself quite a lovely Easter Sunday this 2021. Cheers. I had such a good Easter like even though it wasn't entirely normal still I couldn't see my family I still had such a great day with my parents and I'm just like really thankful for these memories I'm definitely going to reminisce on days like today when I am missing home when I'm on the ship but yeah I'm just so grateful for everything in my life and I'm so excited for what's to come and there is so much to be grateful for and to appreciate so just look at even the smallest things in your daily life and find gratitude but I love you guys all so so much thank you for everything and I will see you guys in my next video bye guys